My background prior to joining here um, was I was quite heavily involved in um, ALN learning, so additional learning needs. Um, and I looked after a team which actually covered the entirety of the UK. So I knew the um, positive nature of virtual training. I knew that it was a fantastic thing to do um, and was quite surprised that we didn't have as much here, although they've done very, very well because obviously we've just come through COVID. Um, so yeah, so I knew that virtual was good. I just knew I needed to implement it a bit further. Again, because of COVID, we had to go virtual. Um, I think actually probably our biggest challenge that we have had is that we were delivering everything via Zoom. And then we got moved over to Teams. We struggled a lot with trying to work out how to deliver effectively and well on Teams virtually. Now at the time it was I wanted to create a better um, landing for our new uh, employees. So at the time um, our induction was done virtually. Um, and it was done via Zoom and it was, it was to be fair, it was pretty good as far as virtual inductions go. But I just thought, mm, I wonder if there's something else that we could do and look outside the box, hence coming to you guys. Um, most of our staff don't live in Cambridge, myself included, because we can't afford to. So to have to pay to travel to come in and all that sort of stuff, it's just, yeah. So actually what we try to do as a trust is really support them. So do virtual learning. So we want to make our virtual learning as best as we possibly can. That's why we wanted to come to you guys to find what else can we do to make it even better for our staff members. Because um, obviously you're amazing. <laughs> so we did a lot of research. Um, I got one of my team members, um, bless them, to do quite a lot of research for me on um, trainers that are out there. I knew I wanted an outside company to come in because I wanted somebody to be objective on what we currently have and what we do. Um, we looked at quite a few different case studies and then came across your team, um, looked through the website, liked the website a lot, um, and then had a really, really good first conversation. Um, I think what did it for me with VTT is that the nature of the beast with the NHS is that it can be very slow. Um, sometimes, because we are ginormous, we've got 12,000 people. Um, so to get all our ducks in a line, it can be very, very, very difficult and very time consuming and quite frustrating. Um, for me, it was a communication, um, if I'm honest with you, it was communication from your company, which was superb because um, as with my role, because I'm head of L&D, um, and I'm sure other heads of L&D will appreciate this, you get hounded so my biggest love was I was never hounded. Um, I was never forced to do anything. I was never pushed. Um, and every time I had issues, it was always with such a sympathetic ear. So for me, that was my absolute standout. That along with the plan was so put into place so quickly. I could see exactly what was going on. Um, and we are, our trainer was a, a specific one for, well, he wasn't specific as such, but he'd worked with the NHS before, which was superb because it meant he understood. Um, and he got amazing feedback from my facilitators who have been in the game a long time. It genuinely was a very, very good training session. Um, and it was quite nerve wracking for me as a new person coming in to basically say to people who've been doing this for 25 plus years, I'm gonna get you some training on how to teach. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> but it paid off because they all said that actually that was really really good so yeah. you can see already now with the work that they are producing it's a billion times better than it was already now it wasn't bad to be fair to start with um but you can see the confidence of them built and they they now have the tools that they need to be able to create this really good training and it's not just virtual either you know they're using the tools that they've learned from the virtual but actually using that to deliver face to face so that for me personally as a manager has been the biggest thing because it's just i mean it's paid for itself just with that it's brilliant uh there's there was nothing more that i could have asked from vtt literally nothing um the service received was second to none. The customer service received was second to none. Um, the training received second to none. It was all of it absolutely spot on and brilliant. So there's nothing more I could have asked from you guys. So it's a thumbs up from me. <laughs> Do it. It's definitely worth it. It's an investment and it's good for your team. Um, it's definitely something you should be doing to invest in the future of your team for learning. So I recommend it entirely.